Recently, smart city has become one of the most emerging concepts in city planning. First, you may think Dubai as a smart city. It's a type of completely artificial city, well known for skyscraper jungle built on desert lands. Singapore, especially Marina Bay area, is a second example. This central district has been redeveloped to become a modern waterfront area in harmony with preserved historical zones. Another example is a preserved, old-looking Copenhagen. The city took the world's top spot in a smart city index in 2017. What a surprise, isn't it? Copenhagen adopts various new smart features as seen inside many buildings. At the same time, it well preserves historical buildings and infrastructures, traditional cultures, and natural environments. Lessons from such highly developed cities like Dubai, Singapore, and Copenhagen are useful for developing cities in other regions such as Asia. The following part introduces key ideas for a post-pandemic smart city model proposed for a fast developing city in Asia and visualized by Shichigaku. Traditionally, our urban life goes around our home or first place, workplace or second place, and then various third places for social activities where we exercise, study, relax, hang out, and socialize. We suggest that home, workplace, and third places should be integrated within a city. And when people look for a new place to live, consideration on third places should become more important than before. Digital transformation has given birth to smart city. And this year, it's been accelerated by a superpower, the COVID-19. It's shaken our world, locked down city, and kicked many activities onto cyber world, including telework, e-learning, and online entertainment. So, smart cities become more present in our new normal. Normally, our urban life comprises of physical and cyber systems. In a smart city, the two systems are well integrated to form a new environment within a city, where people live, work, and socialize in new normal lifestyle. Here, they can utilize cyber system more effectively, live more comfortably with high quality of life, and enjoy rich natural and cultural elements. In short, three key factors supporting such smart city are nature, culture, and cyber. And when various third places become so attractive with all three factors, not only for socializing, but also for teleworking as well, we may fabulously feel our living place is actually not our home, and our workplace is also not our office, but the entire city. And now we would like to introduce Shijigaka's visualizations of such smart city. Like many cities in Asia, this flat river delta area is prone to seasonal floods. The master plan highlights three intersecting axes, culture, nature, and business. It also features five smart infrastructure design that we will introduce in detail.
was our vision of a smart city model for a fast developing city in Asia. The model features advanced cyber systems and their integration with the physical ones. It highlights diverse third places as social and telework places in a post-pandemic world. And it also celebrates local natural and cultural elements and emphasizes on smart infrastructure designs as part of smart city concept. We'll continue to generate more ideas on this topic. If you're interested, please subscribe to our channel and see you soon in our new videos.